Hello friends, myself Amar. In this video, I will discuss one more control of JavaFX that is tree view. Okay. Now, uh, before explaining this code, let me show you the output first. Okay. Now see, here I have written a text this PC and here I have displayed a message. Okay, this is called as the root, and inside this root I have sub items that is C. B and e. these are the sub items, right? Now, how to create this? Let me show you. To create this kind of structure, we need to use a class which is called as tree view class, right? Now, in the tree view, we need to add some items, okay? That to add those items, we need to use another class which is called as tree item. What type of item we will add? We will add string item, right? Here I have given the object name as RT equals to new tree item this PC. This PC is nothing but the text which we are displaying. Okay, and after that comma, then we have written new image view IMG. Now this parameter is optional. If you are giving this parameter, then you will be able to see this image. If you are not giving this parameter, then image will not come. Okay, so here I have written new image view IMG. This IMG is nothing but the object of another class which is called as image, right? So IMG equals to new image, and there here I have given the path of the image which I want to display. Now if you see the path I have given image, this means in the project I have created a folder with the name image, and in the folder I have kept this connect me logo dot png image, right? This means with this particular item, this image will come, right? Now I have written RT dot set expanded true. This means whenever I will execute this program, by default this node will be expanded, right? Now I have created three more three items with the caption C, D, and E. This means these items I have created. Okay. Now these items, that is C, D, and E, should be the child of this PC. This PC means RT. This means item A, item B, and item C must be child of RT. And to do so, here I have used this method RT dot get children dot add all item A, item B, item C. This means item A. Item B and item C will be the child of RT. RT means this PC, right? And now I need to specify that this PC means uh, RT will be the uh, root of the tree view. And to do so, we have a method which is called as set root method. Means in the tree view, that is TV, the object which I have created here, it will have the root as RT. RT means this PC. Mean this PC will be the root, right? And after that, I have added or I have uh, created this container stack pane, and inside this stack pane, I have added the tree view, and that stack pane I have added with the scene, and that scene I have added with the primary stage, and then I have made visible the stage, right? And to use the event again, I have used the same method which I have used in case of combo box or choice box or list box. Okay, I have used the same method, right? This means if you select the item from here, uh, let me show you the output window. Then you will be able to see output. See, as soon as you will select the item, these items will be printed here. Okay, and this is the entire code. This is the entire code which I have written to create the tree view. Okay, if you like my video, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.